production on that record, you know. I love I love the diversity of each song. I love that, you know, you listen to them over and over again and you'll still find something new that and that's 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 exciting to me in music, so um that that was what really, really attracted me to him to work on this record. I think, you know, I think people were surprised first of all and, um, but then I'm getting great reaction. I mean, it's always been played in the radio here and on the single and I'm really happy about that because, you know, we've had such a great time in Spain. I, I love to keep coming. <laughs> um, so, um, I think that it obviously takes, it takes an open mind to listen to it and that everybody should understand. Nobody can keep making the same records. That's that's that is that's not that's not creative, that's not gonna work, you know, for me. It's not gonna fulfill me any. Well the, the song Shame on You is um obviously about war and as far as I'm concerned the immense waste of war, the waste of life and um, and so the the video <coughs> The video is very much a performance video, but um, we have these images. Danny Jacobs did the video, which was great because he'd done like chord videos before, so I was very comfortable with them, as comfortable as I would be in my own, you know. And um, we had these screens up with images that 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 Danny had found of of children. Um, there was like children orphaned by war in Rwanda and, and actual like child sold, soldiers in Burma and really very, very powerful images. Um, so that that was really the main thing within the video and, you know, to, to both further emphasize uh, the catastrophic destruction of um, human life and, and, you know, what people should have in life. Yeah, I suppose it doesn't, the song, like, it doesn't really sound tragic, melodically. I don't know, I always seem to do that somehow. <laughs> Write about sad things and suddenly it sounds happy. happy. Um, um, but I think, um, particularly on the album version, it is more true to what the lyrics are about. Um, the, the radio version is quite dancey. And, um, but within the album version, with, with what Nelly Hooper has produced, I hear, I hear war, you know, I hear submarines, I hear helicopters, I hear everything within the sounds he has used. Um, but, uh, maybe it's something cathartic about it, but I know there's something almost euphoric about the end of it, but maybe there's a thin line between rage and euphoria. It's just, um, I suppose it is. It is through the, you know, from the perspective of us that lose these people in our lives. And at the end of the song, it moves to the character that is the woman that's left behind, you know? And basically that's shame on you to keep my love from me. So that is her rage, you know? And, you know, hurt.